Hello guys and welcome back to my channel, Farrell again. Today we are going to see one of the important questions what we usually get during our firewall or networking interview, which is what is TCP handshake process? On the on this TCP handshake process, the question tweaks like one: What is TCP three-way handshake process? And what is four-way handshake process? So this is how the interviewer tweak the question, but the answer is same. What is what we have in our TCP? Handshake process. So I'm trying to explain you the TCP handshake process and at which stage we call it as a three-way handshake and at which stage we call it as a four-way handshake. So be with me. Consider you have a client machine in your network and you are accessing any website which is hosted on a web server which is at the remote location or in a cl cloud. So this is your client machine, this is your server, uh, which is located in the outside world. So how this client access a particular website from the server? What is essential thing need to be established? First, client establish a TCP three-way handshake or a handshake with the server. Once that is done, the data is communicated and the rest of the things take place. This is the actual TCP handshake process, but how the packet flows and what flags comes into the picture, I wanted to explain you that. So when client wanted to start a communication with the server, which is located in outside world, what he do, he send a sync packet to the server stating that, I wanted to have a communication established with you. In response to sync packet, server sends acknowledgement packet, which is called sync acknowledgement packet for the first packet, which we, uh, which client sent as a sync, and to response to that packet, which is sync acknowledgement packet sent by the server. Stating that, okay, I have received your sync request and uh, I'm acknowledging you that, okay, uh, uh, with the sync act flag. So these are the TCP flags. Sync, act, pin, push, reset. Those are the TCP flags which are used in a TCP uh, handshake process. So I don't want to give you all those details right now but we'll explain you what is the tcp three-way handshake process or four-way handshake process so client and the server first packet sent by the client with the sync fly within it uh, within it acknowledge to the same packet is the Sync act packet from the server. Now, client send the acknowledge to the server, stating that okay, now I have received your acknowledge as well. Now we are able to, you know, uh, or we are in a stage where the communication between the client and server is got established. These three packets together we call it TCP. Three-way handshake. Okay. Now, at this point, the communication between the client and the server is just got established. But there is a no communication over a data is happened. I mean, the communication uh, of data is happened between the client and the server. For example, in your web browser, you're typing, say, I want to access www.google.com. That data, the payload is sent to the server requesting that, okay, what uh, 
the data I want you from the server. Those things is not happen here. So for that, the next packet sends from the client to the server, uh, which requests the data communication, or uh, which gives you the actual uh, communication for the data. Right? Once the data communication is got established, the communication happens, then rest of the packets get sent and from here we start calling it as a four-way handshake this is a four-way handshake so now data communication has happened now client want to finish the con uh, connection with the server so there are the ways the connection get finished or get uh, uh, stopped so one is your proper communication get finished without any interruption so for that tcp fin flag is get set if the connection is get resetted to to uh, you know some uh, uh, about things that time uh, reset flag is set so for the purpose of four way handshake consider uh, the communication between the client and server is getting uh, 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 smoothly terminated or smoothly finished uh, not a terminated smoothly finished so what happens the client sends fin packet finish packet or a set fin flag for the server server acknowledge to fin flag that okay I have received your request for your fin flag. And then server sends response again to the client that as per your finish request or fin flag request, I am finishing the connection what is established between us so again fin acknowledge flag sent to the client and to acknowledge to this client sends the next uh, uh, flag or a packet which says okay now i am acknowledging to your fin that okay this communication is over or finished these four packets which comes after the these three packets all this thing together we call it as tcp four-way handshake so i hope you uh, understand what is the tcp four-way handshake and you found this video informative thanks a lot for watching this video